Listen, Rajiv, it's just not working out as roommates. You've been in your room for weeks. I know you've got this big computer program you're working on, but the rent is way past due. And I know you're not showering because of that body odor. Listen, Cliff, you're not gonna believe this, but I've invented time travel. You mean you've discovered time travel? Same difference. No, they're not actually the same thing. Look, this is the biggest invent discovery of the millennium, and you want to argue about semantics? Okay, fine. You've invented time travel. Just like you invented that coffee machine alarm clock. Oh, come on. Those were second-degree burns. Besides, I already tested it, and it works. You traveled through time. Four years of time. <laughs> Whoa! So you're from the future. Yes, now you understand. I'm... S Wait, are you being sarcastic? Yes! You're not smart enough to invent anything besides a complicated and ridiculous lie. And time travel's impossible! It's possible! Really? Yeah! Then show me! Fine, I will. <laughs> What's that for? You'll see. <laughs> You'll see! Ta-da! Am I supposed to be impressed? Yeah, I programmed it to go five seconds in the future. No, you went into the closet for five seconds, closed the door, and then just came back out. Oh, yeah. For you, it was five seconds. For me, instantaneous. For me, idiotic. Look, it's not a regular closet, okay? Think of it as a wormhole. To what, your dirty laundry? Hey, look, Raj, I'm still here. I have to realign the quantum vest to match your magnetic field. I mean, it's gonna take a few hours. Right, the flux capacitor vacuum. Hey, you know what? I got a Dyson in my room. I should get that, strap it on me, go into the closet for five seconds, go way back in time, and slap a dinosaur. That's completely illogical. Besides, most dinosaurs are actually- uh, Most roommates uh, pay rent, except you. Okay, you're right. I should have paid you a few years ago. Okay, you know what? You just keep it all. That should do it. Freelandia dollars? That's the money of the future! On July 4, 2018, all the countries join in union to fight an alien invasion by creating cybernetic robots that ultimately turn against them. It's pretty sad. Ugh, that's just Independence Day and Terminator combined! Look, just keep this safe and you'll thank me in four years. Look, Rajiv, this is some of the best bullshit you've ever come up with. But it's not working, and I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. I have to leave! It's almost time! He's coming! No, no, I don't think you understand. Uh, who's coming? Don't tell him I was here, and nothing about the time machine. Doc Brown, you're gonna have to stop this charade soon and be honest with yourself. Remember, you know nothing. He must make all discoveries on his own! I, I can't buy this. Just please, come out of there. Rajiv. Rajiv. Raj! Where the hell did he go? Hey. Hey! Where did you just come from? The kitchen. What are you doing in my closet? What am I? Did you just shave? Yeah, a week ago. Had a job interview, but it fell through. Taco trucks. Did you touch my computer? What? No, it... it why? The code's off. It's better, though. He must make all discoveries on his own. Cliff, I know you're here about the rent, dude, but I got a good lead on a lobster truck. Hey, don't worry about the rent, actually. Something came through, I forgot to tell you. Keep working on those computer codes. And I'm, I'm gonna get you another big gulp. I'll be right back. Uh, Slurpee. Slurpee. Dylan. <laughs> Rajiv, there's spiders up there. <gasps> this was a lot simpler when you shaved, Dylan. He's not buying the time travel shtick. Fake money? Shirt from the future? It's rock solid, man. Trust me, I'm older than you. Only by two seconds. Maybe we should just be honest with him and split the rent three ways? <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's dumb. What was that? I don't know. It's me, Cliff. And I have a message from the future. Hey, I got us some Slurpee. Oh, yes. come on, man! You suck in the past. Well, I...